I have here a test tube filled with iron filings and then stoppered at the one end and you can see that when I bring it close to my compass there's really no response to the compass. I'll take my, a strong magnet and again move the magnet in one direction along the test tube. Stroke it underneath. And now I'll bring that close to the compass again. And notice that in this case, the compass really responds strongly to the iron filings. Let me now shake it up. and see what effect that has. And again, there is no effect. What we've done is when I stroke the test tube with the magnet, I'm lining up some iron filings in one direction so that the iron filings become magnetized. So now they're magnetized And when I shake it up again, the filings are randomized and now have no effect. And that's essentially what happens in uh, an iron nail, for example, or in a permanent magnet. The iron atoms are lined up so that their poles are all in the same direction. When you drop a magnet or hit it with a hammer or heat it up, the magnetism can be lost because the iron atoms can change their orientation and become random, much like the iron filings did in this test tube. So this is a good way to illustrate the principle of magnetism. The fact that we need to have the atoms lined up, or the filings have to be lined up in a certain direction in order to show the magnetic effect. We can also show that the iron filings can behave as a bar or cylindrical magnet. I've attached the uh, test tube of iron filings to the wire holder and if I bring now a magnet nearby the one end then is strongly attracted to it. If I turn it around it then turns around as well. If I hold it underneath and rotate it, again we get strong attraction and I can cause also the rotation. So we actually have the filings lined up and magnetized. If we shake it as we did before and now bring the magnet nearby, it still attracts but not as strongly as it did. And part of that is because we get induced magnetism and that causes the iron filings to line up as soon as I bring a strong magnet near it.